video of DAC, we have discussed definition of DAC, types of DAC, DAC using summing amplifier, R to R binary ladder DAC and the problems related to each topic. Part 1 video link is attached in the description box. Please have a look upon it. Output voltage of DAC. In the R to R ladder DAC, the final equivalent circuit is obtained as shown where V R to R represents the Thevenin's equivalent voltage and R represents the Thevenin's equivalent resistance. The output voltage of op amp is V O is equal to minus R F by R into V R to R. If we substitute the value of V R to R, we get the expression as minus V R E F E to R F divided by R into V0 by 2 raised to N plus V1 by 2 raised to N minus 1 plus dot 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 plus Vn minus 1 divided by 2. This expression stands for the output voltage of an n bit DAC. Consider a 3 bit R to R DAC and we are taking V reference is equal to 1 volt and RF is equal to R. Then the expression for output voltage is V0 by 8 plus V1 by 4 plus V2 by 2. So here we are representing the values of output voltages for each consecutive digital input. Now if you look at the values of consecutive output voltage, an interesting fact is that consecutive output voltages are different by a certain value. In this case, there is a difference of 0 0.125 between each output voltages. Resolution. In the previous table, we have seen that the analog output of DAC has discrete values and it is not continuous. That means when the input is changed, the output is also changed with a certain value. Resolution of a D by A converter is defined as the smallest change that can occur in the analog output as a result of a change in the digital input. If the resolution is 1 volt, V output can change by 1 volt when the digital input value is changed. The DAC output can be shown as a staircase form. For a 3-bit DAC, we can show the staircase waveform of DAC like this, where the staircase form represents each levels of output voltage. Here, the full scale voltage is 111, that is 7 volt. So, we have represented the analog output of each digital input. And we can see each levels are different by 1 volt. There are 8 levels and 7 steps. In general, we can say for an n bit DAC, number of levels will be 2 raised to n and number of steps will be 2 raised to n minus 1. In this case, n is equal to 3. So, we will be getting 2 raised to 3 that is 8 levels and number of steps will be 2 raised to n minus 1 that is 7. Resolution can also be represented as the step size or full scale output voltage divided by 2 raised to n minus 1. In this case, the full scale output voltage is 7 volt and 2 raised to n minus 1 is nothing but 7. So we get resolution is equal to 1 volt in this case. So remember the equation for resolution. Resolution is equal to full scale output voltage divided by 2 raised to n minus 1. And the percentage of resolution is equal to step size divided by full scale output voltage into 100. Now let's solve a problem as for gate 2010. The voltage resolution of a 12 bit digital to analog converter whose output varies from minus 10 volt to plus 10 volt is approximately. Full scale output voltage is equal to V maximum minus V minimum. So in this case, we have to take the voltage minus 10 volt to plus 10 volt, where V maximum is plus 10 volt and V minimum is minus 10 volt. So 10 minus minus 10, that is 20 volt. So we got the value of full scale output voltage. Resolution is equal to full scale output voltage divided by 2 raised to n minus 1. Here it is given as 12 bit DAC. That means the value of n is equal to 12. So substitute the values 
then you will get the answer 4.8 millivolt. Now let's see another problem which is asked for NET 2017. The full scale voltage of an N bit digital to analog converter is B. The resolution that can be achieved in it is so it is a direct problem. So we can use the formula FSO 2 raised to n minus 1 where FSO is given as V. So the answer will be V divided by 2 raised to n minus 1. Now let's have a look upon the problem as for GRFNet 2018. The full scale of a 3 bit digital to analog converter is 7 volt. Which of the following tables represents the output voltage of this 3 bit DAC for the given set of input bits? So, in the options, you can see same input bits are given in all the tables but different output voltages. So, the information given here is it is a 3 bit DAC and full scale voltage is 7 volt. So, with this information, we have to find out the resolution and through the resolution value, we have to fix the output voltage. Resolution is equal to FSO divided by 2 raised to n minus 1. Substitute the values 7 for FSO and 3 for n. Then you will get resolution is equal to 1 volt. So the first input value can be represented by 0 volt and next output value will be having the difference of 1 volt. So the next output voltage corresponds to the next input voltage 0, 0, 001 is equal to 1 volt and 0, 010 0 gives the output voltage of 2 volt and 0, 011 1, 1 gives the output voltage of 3 volt. So you will be getting the range of output voltage like this. Just have a look upon this problem. A 5 bit T by A converter produces P out is equal to 0 0.2 volt for a digital input of 0, 0, 0, 0, 001. Find the value of V output for an input of 11111. Here a 5 bit DAC is given. Step size or resolution is equal to 0 0.2 volt. Why? Because for the first step, the output voltage is 0 0.2 volt. 11111 corresponds to the input for the full scale output. Full scale output is equal to 2 raised to n minus 1 into resolution. Just substitute the values. Then you will get the full scale output value as 6.2 volt. So the digital input 11111 can be represented as the analog output as 6.2 volt.